Hey friends, welcome to my new video. This is Rukshika Rajkumar from Arduino Projects by R and today I'm going to present to you my security system using the vibration sensor. In this project you will be needing an Arduino Nano, an LED, a vibration sensor module, an RF433 MHz transmitter module, Arduino Uno, RF433 MHz receiver module, 16 by 2 LED with I2C interface, and a solderless breadboard as well. In this project, I have made a transmitter circuit as well as my receiver circuit. Now, let me explain you how this works. This vibration sensor module will detect any vibrations across the solderless breadboard and once a vibration is detected, it sends a high signal to my Arduino Nano microcontroller which then turns on my LED and triggers the RF433 MHz transmitter module. This sends RF signals to my RF receiver over here and once this receives the accurate decimal code, this LED will light up and you will be seeing uh, a message in this LCD screen saying that a shock is detected. This example can be used in many places. For example, this can be used in a baby cot. When the baby wakes up, there will be a small vibration in the cot and this can be used to send a message to the RF receiver and we'll be able to know when the baby is awake. The RF transmitter and receiver can communicate for 3 meters up to 100 meters without an antenna. Let me explain you the connections. The vibration sensor module is connected to D7. The RF transmitter module is connected to D10. The LED over here is connected to D2. This LED is connected to D12. The RF receiver module is connected to D2. The SDA pin is connected to A4 and the SCL pin is connected to A5. The RF receiver module contains two data pins and any one of them can be connected to the data pin over here. You don't have to use both pins in this example. To learn how I did this project, please visit my blog. The link can be found in the description below. Now let me show you how this works. Thanks for watching. 
subscribe to my youtube channel and follow my blog to stay updated with my latest projects and tutorials don't forget to comment like and share